Hey guys, welcome. My name is Hondo and I'm with a Wraps. Wraps. Today I'm going to be showing you guys how to work with Tiny Bot Ultra Mat uh, series. This film is a little bit more delicate than other ones. And I'm going to be giving you guys some tips and tricks about how to get a clean install on this fender. I'm going to lay it down real quick. Again, um, pretty easy. Just uh, grab one corner, peel the back. I'm going to tack it onto the body of the car. And go to the other side. Take the backing off. You want to grab this film real quick. Make it easier for yourself. It. Real quick like that. Now we're going to focus on the front end of the fender. I don't want to lift just the corner of it because the material is pretty sensitive. And if I go to heat a little portion, it's going to turn kind of glossy. And that's not what you're going to want. So what I do is I lift up a good portion. I use, I use more air than heat just to make it soft enough. I'm going to go ahead and just heat up the whole area. I want, I want to make sure that the heat gun's moving around. You don't want to keep it too, um, you don't want to keep it at a, at a certain, you know, like a close at an angle, because it is going to end up making it glossy, so that's not what you're going to want. So just keep moving it around. Moving it, keep moving it. And you're going to want, you're going to want these wrinkles to go away. The more wrinkles you can get away with it, the, the, the better the film's going to lay. Just keep moving it. So now I'm going to grab it. And just take it down. Just like that. You know, regularly just squeegee it. Just like that. Okay. I'm going to go ahead and cut it over here. I can show you guys how to how to tuck this in. Okay, for these corners, what, what I like to do is um I like to lift it up and pull a little bit and push it underneath. When I heat it, it's gonna shrink and it's gonna go underneath. So now if you look back here. You know, it, it kind of already grabbed it, so it, really, it already did half of the work. Now you just need to cut it and post it. It's even in this streak underneath to the back. You know, so, again, this, this area you can just kind of cut. And you're just going to heat it. Make sure you know you keep the heat moving. I'm going to push it in regularly. Again, see if you need this corner, a little pull, take it underneath, and heat it, and it's going to shrink. It's going to grab the corner. Just tuck it in regularly. I'm just going to go ahead and just cut that in the bottom. Now, when I do that, let me pull this, this hood up with it. I see it you. Alright, so then when I do these corners, I'm gonna clean heat up. This material, you can post heat it, but you gotta be really careful. Because if you leave it for too long, it's gonna turn gloss. So I like to keep it keep the heat moving. Now this is the corner. Now I'm going to show you guys how the iron installer has been working. So I'm not going to cut this film on the edge. I'm actually going to give it about an eighth of an inch. I'm going to cut up. An eighth of an inch. Just because this film will, you know, will shrink a little bit. like that so then again 
I'm gonna go back to the heat gun. I'm gonna heat it, and I'm just gonna push it to the back. Like that. And just keep the keep the keep the heat gun moving when you're pulse heating. You're not really pulsing this thumb because it's gonna turn gloss. So you're gonna want to keep it moving around back and forth. And that's pretty much. Um, that's pretty much how you're gonna go about doing all the corners on the on the you know the bumpers, the doors, fenders, the hood. And you know, make sure you give it a little bit extra to tuck into the back. Pulse heat it, and you should be solid. You should be good to go. All right, guys. So that was the specifics about how I took this Ultra Map film from TinyBot. We are going to be dropping another film that's going to be showing the full completion of the fender. So stay tuned for that. Thank you guys so much for watching once again. Please, guys, stay tuned for our next videos. Make sure you like subscribe, comment below what you want us to cover next. We want to go over the tips and tricks, everything that you need to become a pro installer. We love you guys. Thank you again.